What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Raven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through another speed run of battling different trainers and all that stuff, trying to get uh, some of our Pokemon up to level 40, and we did. As you can see, all six of them are at level 40. Now, Sir Razor was the last one to grow to level 40. I had to go battle a bunch of grass type Pokemon. Yeah. And, oh, yeah, we also captured Patrick. Now, if you guys don't remember, Patrick is, uh, let me show you, let me show you. Let me show you who this guy is, because uh, it's a little bit funny who Patrick is. Let's go right ahead and uh, show you Patrick. Where the heck are you, Patrick? God dang it. Ah, there you are. Okay, so yes, off screen, we caught ourselves Staryu, the star-shaped Pokemon. As long as the center section is unharmed, it can grow back fully, even if it's chopped uh, to bits. Okay, so... Some of you guys already know that I've captured a Staryu back in Pokemon Leaf Green. Kind of messed up the whole team dynamic and whatnot. And last episode, I mentioned to you guys that I've caught a nice amount of Pokemon in the Safari Zone that I kind of want to use in my Pokemon Journeys HD channel where I have them on either red or blue. So comment down below again, guys. I added Staryu to the mix right here so I can trade them to uh, these games right here. Now... In this episode, we're going to be battling Koga. Hopefully these levels are, you know, hopefully these levels are actually going to help us out. Because in Pokemon Yellow, Koga gets a nice boost in a, in a, in a level. So what's going to happen is we're going to start battling some trainers first that have psychic capabilities like this guy. Let's see, be, let's see you beat my special techniques. Now there are only, okay, if anything... This is not a poison type gym per se. It's more of a special type, uh, special technique train uh, gym. I don't know, special move kind of gym. Um, a lot of these Pokemon that they're battling with, they like to use, uh, they like to use special techniques. And yes, yeah, some of it has to be. Uh, some of them is poison type techniques too. But not all of these guys have poison type Pokemon. They all have like some kind of psychic type Pokemon, like this guy right here, who has two psychic types. And the best way to defeat a Kadabra, Alakazam, and all that stuff is to be very physical with it. Because, well, there's only one real ghost type and bug type move. Comment down below on, the, on that one. And yes, I had you fooled right here. So, yes, we're going to be battling a lot of guys. Strength isn't the key for Pokemon. It's strategy. I'll show you how strategy can beat brute strength. Hmm. Yeah, they're, they're, they're taking this model a little too seriously. So here we go, taking on a juggler. And juggler is going to be coming out with his Hypno right here. Now, Hypno does have poison gas, the fart attack. And, well, we're going to be going straight for a slash attack right here. And that hits it pretty good. And here is a fart attack. Not great. So here we go, Dragon Rage, automatic 40 points. And it nearly does it, but we're getting hurt with the poison right here. And here comes a psychic attack. This right here is going to mess us up just a little bit. Okay, so here we go. Finish it off with a, a slash attack. And just like that, Hypno has been defeated. And, well, look at that juggler. Not feeling so good. What? Extraordinary. Yes. Okay, so one big thing about this gym. Make sure to bring a lot of full heals, guys, because uh, they do like to mess with your status. And uh, the best way to defeat a poison type Pokemon is through psychic type or ground type. And the good thing is that I have one of two. So what's going to happen is I'm probably going to be using Terramon a lot too. So let's go ahead and switch that out. Yeah, all my Pokemon level 40 through all this training. <laughs> I wanted to become a ninja, so I joined this gym. Hmm. You don't say. Okay. Here we go, taking on another juggler, and he has four Pokemon, and one of them happens to be a Drowsy. Look at you, okay. Terramon, let's go. Okay, let's go right ahead and go with the Strength Attack right here. I'm going to save those Earthquakes for, like, specific Pokemon right here. As you can see, Drowsy has been defeated, and, well, let's go again with another Drowsy. So let's continue on with Terramon, and, well, look at that. Oh, yes, oh, yeah. Drowsy has been yet again defeated, and, well, we're about to see another Kadabra, so let's continue on. Kadabra is looking, uh, well, it's not looking up the part right here, because we're a little overleveled for these guys, 
But when it comes to Koga himself, no, it's no, no, they're not. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're we're not over leveled, not the least bit. So here we go, another drowsy. Let's continue on with the strength onslaught right here. Look at this strength technique for the win. And just oh wow, I was about to say just like that. And well, yeah, we're confused now. So let's go ahead and see if we can get a rock slide in. And just like that, rock slide. Hits this drowsy for the win. Look at that. Terramon being the terrible Pokemon that it is. And, well, this guy's like, I'm done for. Yes, you are. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out to Leah right here. Now, Pokemon that I don't want to use is Sir Razor because, well, yeah, it is a... It is, it is a grass and poison type Pokemon, but it won't... The moveset that it has, it's not going to help. And here we have a Tamer. And this guy's coming out with an Arbok, a true poison type Pokemon. So, yeah, we're going to have a little bit of trouble right here. So, here we go. Thunderbolt for the win. And, uh, well, there's that Leer attack. And so far, we haven't gotten that. We haven't gotten paralyzed a lot. And look at that. Arbok defeated. Look at this. Okay. And well, he's coming out with a sand slash. And now we're giving a, now he's giving us a fighting chance. Let's go with Sir Razor, mainly because since Sand Slash does no poison sting. We don't we don't want any of that mess. So let's go straight for a Mega Drain attack right here. And the Mega Drain does its trick, gives it to 1 HP. Unfortunately, we get a sand attack. So let's see if we can get one more in and that right there works. Look at you. Okay, Sand Slash. Getting your butt kicked. And, well, coming out with another Arbok. Let's go straight to Ultra Psycho. Let's make a... Uh, yeah, let's destroy this Pokemon right here. Little bit of a Ultra Psycho. See what it can do. Let's go with a freaking uh, Psychic Attack right here. And just like that, Arbok has been defeated. Big, big, big Psychic Attack right there. And, uh, well, Tamers, you gotta, you gotta give it to the Tamers right here, because they do like to use exotic Pokemon. And, let's see, you know what, let's go straight for a Leo. Let's battle everybody. Master Koga comes from a long line of ninjas. What did you, where did you descend from? I don't know. The Pokemon games. Probably, I don't know. Okay, so here we have another juggler, and he is gonna be coming out with a Drowsy right here. And a Drowsy... Get ready for this body slam right here. And look at that. Okay, a critical hit. And here comes a confusion attack. And that one hits us pretty hard. So let's go again. One more. Come on. And there we go. Body slam for the win. Just like that. Okay, so this guy's about to come out with a hypno. Do not want to mess with that. So let's go straight to Torpedo. I wonder if Torpedo can actually do this, okay? This is first battle in... Yeah, before it turned to level 40. And it, it could have learned Dragon Rage, which I could teach it. I don't know. Kinda I kinda thinking of uh thinking about it right now. And well look at that. Headbutt attack. And that right there is gonna hit us pretty hard. But here we go again with another surf attack. And just like that, Hypno has been defeated. And there's that boosted stat, and well, this guy's like, drop my balls! <laughs> yes, you dropped all of your balls. That seems to be a personal problem. So now, let's go right ahead and... Let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's go straight to Godzilla, Godzilla. At this point in the game, it's not about who's the strongest Pokemon, but how we, you know, how we maintain our team. And as far as I'm concerned, my team is uh, it's right there. Now... I guess you could say I'm trying to get my team up to level 50. That is probably where, like, you know, the goal is. Uh, I do have the I do have the speed button, so it can happen. It's just we're going to have to go straight into the victory road to actually accomplish that. And it's going to be a lot of training right there. So let's go straight for a bubbly beam. And there we go. Look at that. Okay, Sand Slash defeated. Going into the next gym, there's not going to be a lot of trainers going in guys so again maintain your Pokemon uh, me getting them up to level 40 is you know it's kind of a miracle right there 
And, well, here we have Arbok looking like a big old mean cobra right here. But this mean cobra is going to get this big old mean psychic attack. And there we go. Arbok has been defeated. I am feeling good. And, uh, well, Tamer's like not happy. Whoa! He's got it. Yes, I do. And, well, that is pretty much all those trainers right there. So, before we do anything, guys, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. This is going to be... This is going to be an interesting battle, to say the least, right here, okay? And I do not know why they put the Pokemon to... Well, they have the Pokemon like this. So, we're going to start off with Godzilla and work from there. <laughs> A mere child like you dares to challenge me? Very well. I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. You shall feel the despair of poison and sleep techniques. I love this song, guys. Okay, here we go, guys. Taking on Koga himself, the ninja master, and he has nothing but venonats. And, yeah, they're all above level 40, so you guys got to be aware of that stuff. And every single one of these Venonat, they have some kind of a uh, messed up technique. So, yeah, make sure to have a, a flying type, a, uh, a rock type. Heck, you know, uh, even use an ice type. So what we're going to do right here, we're just going to do flies. Now, every single one of these Pokemon increased by two levels until he gets to Venomoth. And just like that, this guy, yeah, okay, so he's, like it says, it, it's, yeah, these guys like to be strategic, so what we're going to do is just, we're going to beat it out with Godzilla, because, yeah, <laughs> there's no way around it, and Godzilla grows to level 41 right here, and he's going to be coming out with another Venonat right here, so let's go right ahead, and this is where Flamethrower comes into play, like, I, I would really love it if, you know, Flamethrower was a little bit earlier. And as you can see, Toxic is one of these moves that they guy, th these guys have. And just like that, we defeat this Venonat. Now, here comes a Venomoth. Let's go right ahead and take it on with our Pikachu. Venomoth is at level 50. That is a scary thought. And just like that, it likes to use Psychic. 10 levels above its... Uh, yeah, holy crud. Okay, so our special has fallen. But... We're going to do our job right here by paralyzing it, and I'm going to be switching it out to Terramon right here. Because, well, Terramon is a Rock-type Pokemon, and yes, these Psychic Attacks won't really last much. As you can see, it hits me pretty hard, and that was a critical hit, so let's go again with the Rock Slide. Since we are faster than Venomoth right now, and look at that, super effective. Almost beats it, and well, Venomoth, yes, uh, Venomoth is doing its thing right here, but here comes another Rock Slide attack for the win. Eat it, Venomoth, eat it. And just like that, guys, we have defeated Koga for our sixth badge. Yeah, not fifth, not fourth, sixth badge. And yes, you have proven your worth. Here, take this soul badge. Alrighty, okay, now that you have the soul badge, the defense of your Pokemon increases. It also lets you use Surf outside of battle. Ah, take this too. And we get ourselves the TM06, which is toxic. It is a secret technique over 400 years old. When afflicted by toxic, Pokemon suffer more and more as the battle progresses. It will surely terrorize foes. Okay, alrighty, so yeah, look at that guys, we are six badges in. I think we did a good job, a very, very good job of taking on Koga right here, and uh, well, I couldn't be happier. Let's see what this guy has to say. It's amazing how ninja can terrify even now. Eh, no, not really. Okay, so that is that right there, guys. Um, we now have the capability of surfing, okay? That is huge right here into this game. The world has opened up to us, and... Like I said early on, or early on into this walkthrough, I am going to be capturing the legendary Pokemon at the very end. So we're going to be skipping the Cinnabar, or the Celadon, or the Seafoam Islands. We're going to be skipping the Power Plant. Even when we go into the Power Plant, we're going to be skipping that because, well, you know, there's a Moltres right there. We're going to save all that for later. What's going to happen here is 
We're going to be going back to Pallet Town, and we're going to be going down there, battling a whole bunch of trainers, getting to Cinnabar Island, taking care of business right there, and, uh, well, making our way to the 8th badge and all that stuff. So we are very close to finishing up this walkthrough. It's just uh, very, very hectic, guys. So, again, red, blue, and possibly green, guys. If you guys want to pick out a team with, with the Pokemon that I've captured over at the Safari Zone, including the last episode... Comment down below to tell me what Pokemon you want me to trade over to Red and Blue. And uh, remember, in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Green, I am picking the Pokemon specific to their color. So if you're playing, if I'm playing Pokemon Blue, it's Squirtle, Red, it's going to be Charizard or Charmander, and then Green, it's going to be Bulbasaur. So just be aware of that. Make sure that you know the teams are logical for all this stuff right here. So thank you guys again for watching. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. You know, the whole notification button and all that stuff. And if you guys want to make a small donation right here, link's in the description. I will be back for another episode of Pokemon Yellow right here. See you guys.